Hello guys, this video won't be long, just my thoughts on this weekend's boxing. Start with the, the um, main topic, the Alicia Bongano versus Christina Lagnatu fight. Very dominant performance, very, very dominant. Pretty much everyone, every single round. I don't think half a round, maybe two rounds have been generous. But arguably, you can argue pretty much every round was dominated by Bob Garner, just very assertive about punches. Because they did try at time, but she couldn't get any rhythm going whatsoever. So it's extremely dominant performance. And not competitive at all. I thought it would be way more competitive, but Gungana just couldn't get away with it. Couldn't get any meaningful shots. Mumble Ghana and very dumb performance. Go for Serrano or go for the winner of Katie Taylor. The Jim Kang going match, either those two. Either Serrano next or go for the winner of Taylor and um, Shank Cameron. That's the, that's the way. There's plenty of options for Bungana in those weight classes. Yeah, but Ghana, well, yeah, definitely one of the stars in female boxing. And up on the way to for her to do two more in boxing. All the thoughts is um as expected, no surprise. And uh, Tifon Lopez is not gonna not gonna retire after all and calls it calls out Damon Haney for sure at one forty. Uh, Haney like and um, has got a lot of options. He can even be much lower mode. Which I think he will do because he's uh, a top one fighter of the most top one fighters. Or he can go to one forty and fight Tank, Garcia or Haney. So he's one of the best position boxers right now. He has got so many options to go to, or he can even one thirty five and go after um, Ross is there. What's the name? Longchenko. He can fight tank at one thirty five as well, even. But a lot of options for Haney. A lot, a lot of options. But anyway, that's my thoughts, guys. Come and subscribe, guys. Take care.